Hello everyone! This is the first video about creating a simple battleship game where we can control this yellow submarine and launch torpedoes to sink some ships. In this particular video I will show you how this waving sea is done using just one wave sprite and simple script to move it to the left and to the right. So here we have wave parent empty game object that has about 20 children which are our waves. Take a look at the first one. I use this single sprite to create this entire sea. Delete it. OK. Here is the first wave with this transform with white color tint and ordinary layer equals to 100. So this first wave is rendered in the first place. The second wave is positioned a bit higher and has darker tint. Here it is. Its ordinary layer is 95, so it's rendered behind the first wave. Third wave is a bit higher than the second one, has white tint and ordinary layer is 90. And so on each following wave game object has white or dark tint and lower ordinary layer value. So the last wave has its ordinary layer equals to 0. To create that wave effect, each wave has movement script attached with direction value between positive 1 and negative 1 for each wave. So it allows us to move them in different directions to each other. Let's take a look at this script. Here we have vector to initial position variable, public float direction value that we can modify in inspector and frequency and magnitude float variables. At the start, we set initial position and calculate frequency and magnitude randomly to be different for each wave. Frequency stands for some kind of move speed of a wave. Magnitude stands for maximum distance that wave goes from one extreme point to another. In update method, we set position in X axis using mathfsign function calculating its value according to frequency multiplied by time dot time value and multiplied by magnitude and direction. So in the end, each wave has its own move cycle. Here we go. Get hypnotized. OK. Next video is about submarine movement and torpedo launching. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.